What's up guys, I'm Lucy from back in the vlog vlog guys. Today's vlog, of course, not easily yet. Today's vlog, Southampton versus Brighton. So, I was in Italy, I was easy, not, doesn't have game takers, stop what went through the FA Cup. Looking forward to Southampton game, not been to St. Mary's in a very long time. As a fan, can't remember when the last time I went. So, it'll be interesting what the fans are like this season. But yeah, of course, I'm in the, the Saints vlog. Right, Davies. Hello. How are you doing? So, I don't, I don't know what to expect this team. So, how, how good they've been this season? Well, we're good at home. We don't get to score many. We haven't conceded many. But away from home, we've been shocking. Drew 2-2 to Leicester midweek. Probably should have got maybe something more there, but yeah. It, it'll be a tough game today. We never do well against Brighton at home for some reason. But yeah. So, uh, Brighton, obviously. Last game they drew one one. I think West Ham more played a red kick. So West Ham did good, very good this season. But yeah, a car. What the? Get that on the floor. Yeah, a car. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> no, a car. But yeah. So why is the competition on his vlog? I did two two. So I'm going to stick by it. Go two two. I, I would love to see an interesting game. But I just thought we got right and see. It depends what team has to that plays out. Che Adams is scoring. Tell oh him. yes, indeed. I've heard it here first. That's a spoiler. Okay. <laughs> Wait and see.
Guys, just end the vlog. What a game for our neutral. Obviously, 1 1. More play with 98th minute equaliser. I said that's a very good game, but for Southampton fans, they should have, I should say, Southampton players, they should have basically put the game to play in the first half. Had so many chances, they could have been an easy 3 0 up in the first half, but clearly that's what they're lacking this season, creating the goals, which for me, that game, you can, cannot blame Hassan at all. But that game there, it was down to the players. They couldn't score at all. Um, Brighton's keeper made so many mistakes after they finally capitalised on one of them. But they, they could have scored more than three goals, I could say. But Brighton hanged on. Didn't play the best of, of their games. But they hanged on and managed to get the equaliser right at the death of the, uh, death of the game. And I could say that's Walprowse's fault. I see Romero's fault for making the foul. But... And then Walpole's fault for him going back to the goal line to make, be the hero and save off the line. But for doing that, he played more play on side. And there you go, he just scores that equaliser. And he's just a Saints fan, which to me, I found that quite funny. Obviously, I'm not a Saints fan, but I'm, I'm a neutral fan. So from um, Morpé, he has his back to back get aims. He's scoring in, in late in the death of the game, West Ham and Southampton. So. For um, Brighton fans, that's a good away day for them. But Saints, as a home performance, they should have done way better. But, yeah, I think one Brighton player did get injured, I think. I think he might have dislocated his shoulder. I think, I'm not too sure it was. But hopefully it's a speed recovery for him. Because it looked like a very serious injury. The game stopped for at least six or seven minutes. And that's why it was 10 minutes at a time. But hopefully he makes a speed recovery speed recovery and on time to the next game they've got Arsenal away so Arsenal this season had had poor start then Brang come back in, in the last five games so Southampton Sam, has to go out we're trying to win that game but it's gonna be very difficult but for Brighton there was delays for their fans to get home so hopefully majority then didn't make it safe home so Eastley's next game is next Saturday which is against Oldershot at home but there's a game on the Tuesday um, against Hammond Waterlooville in the Hampshire Sydney Cup. So I possibly most likely go to that game if I so if the vlog goes goes up then on that Tuesday night or Wednesday, uh, Wednesday afternoon somewhere, then obviously that's me going to the game. If not, it'll be an old shot on the Saturday. So if you enjoyed this vlog, give it a like, subscribe if you're new, and I hope you'll see you Tuesday.